Uh, I've never been to Belgium. You have been, right? Or no? No, I haven't been to Belgium. Oh. I should go to Belgium. I'll tell you something. Yeah. I've never been to Bruges. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I actually, I did fly to Bruges once, so yes. You did? Yeah. So you've seen more of Belgium than I did. <laughs> I'm not going to tell anybody that, though. <laughs> Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> that never happened. Yeah. What are your neighbors like in real life? Um, well, I have a house in LA and a house in England. My the house in England, mm -hmm. my neighbor is Theresa May. Okay. Yeah. So I got a prime minister as yeah. a neighbor. So there I'm covered, you know. And then uh, and then in Los Angeles, my neighbors are very kind. My neighbor next to me, a guy named Jerry London. Uh, as a director, mm -hmm. and uh, and is has been nothing but a fine neighbor for 25 years. Yeah, I wonder what Theresa May would say if I asked her the same question about you. Mm. Well, I think I think I'm okay with them because we, yeah. you know, we did some construction on the house, but we did it quickly, uh -huh. which is the <laughs> secret. You got to do everything <laughs> fast, and uh, and the house is much nicer. Yeah. Now. Well, I, I think you'd be a, a fun neighbor. I'm a fun yeah. neighbor, man. Yeah. I'm, I'm, you know, I, I, I go. I bring cups of sugar and things. My, my next door neighbor in England is actually a dinner theater. Uh huh. So I get to go to the dinner theater and watch plays. And you bring Casamigos, obviously. I have brought bottles of Casamigos to the local pub. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. All right. What if I were to give your anonymity back, mm. and I, I told you like, okay, you can live wherever you want. Yeah. Where would that be? The place, the city that would be the most fun to live if you weren't well known would be New York. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, you know, I think it's the greatest city in the world. And I, it's not the greatest city when you're well known because it, it never lets up. You mm -hmm. know, there's no let up. There's the minute you walk out the door, it's, uh, you know, four million people in your yeah. face. But, uh, but when I was younger and I went there, man, I just, uh, to, just a walk between the museums and the park and, and, the amount of culture and the different culture that comes at you at once, I, right there would be the spot. Mm -hmm. Now speaking when you were younger, what's like the one conversation that you had at the dinner table with your dad mm -hmm. that stuck with you? Um, I think the one that always stuck with me was my father would always insist that we, uh, you know, that we have to look out for other people, you mm -hmm. know. There was always a big part of it was that, you know, you have a responsibility. You know, we were pretty broke when I was young. My mom made all my clothes for me and things. Oh, but, I never knew that. But we didn't really know it. You know, we, ne we were never told that we were and uh, never felt that we were. And, uh, and we always felt sort of very wealthy in, in love and kindness. And I think our parents always felt that that should be shared with other people as well. Mm -hmm. You know, we interviewed Matt yesterday, and he mentioned that um, he told you that you were expecting, you and Amal were expecting twins when you guys were on set. Right. So do you remember when you found out that you guys were expecting twins? What was that like? Well, it was, <laughs> well I was, it was, you know, six hours before I told Matt, because we, oh. you know, we thought, you know, we were trying, and we thought that she might be pregnant. We went to the doctor, and we did that thing, you know, and he goes, yeah, there's the baby. And he goes, and there's the other one. And I was like, the other one? <laughs> what are you talking about? And so I was kind of in shock, and I went to work that day, and I was sitting with Matt, and I go, I'm going to have twins. He's like, shut up. Don't tell anybody. And I was like, oh, it just happened. I don't know. <laughs> so it happened pretty quick. Yeah. I think they just gave me the wrap, but oh, really? best day of your life, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thank you have so much.